Okay, so you get those scars, and they'll be like, I'm not wearing any makeup today, and I'm just gonna put my hair up in a scruffy thing like this, not wear my contacts, and just put my glasses on. And they look hot, but unfortunately, that look doesn't work for me. So hi guys, how's it going? A long time no vlog, but I'm in the mood for vlogging, so here we are. Uh, yeah, so I don't exactly look very pretty today, but it's cool. We are just getting personal here. I thought I would show you my um, mess, I guess. So, blah, blah, blah. So if you guys uh, are subscribed to my main channel, you know I now make hair bows and I sell them on my Facebook page. And I'm running out of storage ideas. Things are getting really out of hand. Look. So over in those baskets there, we've got like completed hair bows. We've got a box with hair bows and a bag full of all this lovely beautiful ribbon and I'm in the middle of kind of like rolling some up and sticking pins in them uh, we've got like ribbon scraps that aren't the right kind of size to make a bow with we've got Justin Bieber there which I don't really like him no offense and oh I've even got like candy crush ribbon that's pretty darn cool and these are like all my flowers to put on headbands and just let's look right in here yeah it's a mess so my plan is to kind of like suss out how I'm going to organise it better. Um, it doesn't help that I haven't got like my own space to put it in. I just have to like put it in that big tub and it's like ugh, so depressing. So, so depressing. <coughs> Molly, <coughs> just eat it. Just eat it. Stop barking at it. <coughs> Molly. Uh, she always does that with her biscuits. It's um, a bit embarrassing when people come around and they're like, what's she barking at? I'm like, well, actually, she's barking at her biscuit. <laughs> Originally, I was going to do a video um, about my new glasses because um, I guess you haven't seen these ones before. But that didn't really happen, so here's my new glasses. Blah, blah, blah. Anyway, um, I don't know if you guys ever watch Extreme Couponing on TLC, but I love that programme, and it kind of inspired me to kind of like save coupons and use them because I don't know if you're like me, I will go in the newspaper, just flip past the coupons and don't pay any attention, but I thought I would um, start keeping them and stuff. This one, it says, congratulations, you're a winner. You get a free pizza uh, worth 2 99 basically. Um, so up to the value of 2 99 And if you go on the, how do you pronounce it? Pana Panabello? Yeah, if you go on the Panabello website, you can actually claim a free pizza and they will send you a coupon for that and that would work in the shops. Tesco, Asda, Sainsbury's and Waitrose. And then I've also got this one here, which is 20% off a Manuka Manu 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 doctor. Um, I got this because I applied for some free samples of their like creams and stuff and they sent that as well and I actually really like their stuff so I will be using that. And then I also came across this in the Sun newspaper. Um, deposit £10, get £30 to play plus a £10 love to shop gift card when you join and that is for Sun Bingo so I'm thinking about doing that one. And then I also came across this in the paper. Uh, two for one Odeon cinema tickets for the weekend. So that should be pretty, pretty, pretty good. Yeah, so if you guys coupon, I think you should let me know like some of your tips and tricks because obviously I don't really have that many coupons and I'm kind of new to it all. Seriously, seriously, do not know what to do with all <coughs> of this. Molly, shut up. Look at this. Oh, it's so stressful. Oh, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I get, I always, um, every like so often, like once a week or something, I'll sit down with all my ribbons, like, yeah, I'm going to sort this out. It doesn't really happen. I only like half do it and then I get stressed out and stop. So I've got to really do it. Really do it indeed. Yeah. But I'll show you some of my ribbons, actually, if you're interested. Let me show you. Um, these ones here are all made up on clips. Um. Basically, when I do little craft stools, it's handy because I can just literally set up by picking the strip up, like so, and place it down on the table. Bam! It's done. So, that is pretty easy. That is probably, like, the easiest way to set up a craft stool. I really like this ribbon up here. It's, like, um, what do you call it? Like, comic pick book strip. It says, Pow, Zap, Bang. We've got some Angry Birds, Ghostbusters, Harry Potter, Minions... Um, JLS, Winnie the Pooh, Barbie, 
all goes up and then of course I've got Disney princesses, I've got Frozen as well and then we've got some for like the older generation like polka dots and stuff like that and then for you One Direction fans we have got One Direction one Direction hair bows. They are probably, oh, I've got loads more, but the One Direction ones probably seem to be the most popular. Oh God, I've only got five minutes left on my camera. Mm. Right, okay. I'm gonna go now, guys. Make sure you're subscribed to this uh, channel and you like the video, and if you want to, share it with your friends. And I will have a new main channel video shortly. Wicked. All right then, I'm gonna go now. 